if you're one of those people who's trying out affirmations and you feel like it's the right thing to do, you're like, okay, I'm going to do these affirmations. And then you, you feel it. And then the next day, maybe you don't feel it so much. And, and then you start to doubt yourself. Let me tell you, as someone who has been doing them for months now, years, continue. I'm telling you to continue. You will feel it more and more. And you will feel it authentically. You're not lying to yourself. You're not tricking yourself. That's the doubt that creeps in our head is, oh, I'm just I'm just bullshitting myself. It's not true. We live in a relative universe. All these possibilities are real. You can say left and you can say right, and both of them are true. Our consciousness has a size. It has a capacity. And it may not be able to hold left and right at the same time. But that's not because they're not true. It's just because the size and our capacity of our consciousness is only so big. So when you're saying your affirmation, it's true. And there are reasons that it falls out of your consciousness and you disbelieve that it's true. Because of the size of your consciousness, it's too big of a thought. It's too big of an affirmation. So doing affirmations is practice. It's making you stronger. And it's constantly reminding yourself that, hey, this is true. So the more you do it, the more you're going to feel it, the more it's going to feel true, even though it's true the whole time. So my point is, keep going. You can't see where it's going to take you. You can't see it. You have to go. You have to get there. So that's it. Good luck.